Hey guys, so it's time for a new declutter video and I honestly just basically woke up so I know I look kind of weird but you guys are used to that like you guys are used to seeing me with no makeup so I don't care really but in my last video I showed you guys my lipstick declutter but I also have a lot of other lip products that are not lipsticks so in today's video I'm going to go through all of my lip glosses, liquid lipsticks, lip liner so I can't wait to get rid of some more lip products and it's just so refreshing and so it just feels so good getting rid of some things that you just never use and I don't know it feels really good and that's why I do these declutter videos so I can inspire you guys to also clean out your makeup and also other areas in your home. If you want to see my lip product declutter video then just keep on watching. So I'm going to move on to lip glosses. So here we have some of my lip glosses. All of these are from Neil and Sue and I'm ready to part ways with them except one color and this is called 746. I love this. It kind of reminds me of like a, I don't know, a, like a latte mocha color. I don't know. I love it. It's like the perfect like cool nude. I love it. So I'm keeping that. I'm going to get rid of all of these other ones even though they're stunning. I just don't need them anymore because I can't show them on my channel because you guys can get them. But I'm going to keep all of my Maybelline Color Elixir I think they're called. These are so so good but I'm not sure if they still make it because I don't know. I've been having some hard time finding them but these are amazing and also my NYX lip glosses I love. This one if I'm keeping one coral lipstick it's going to be the Maybelline one so I'm going to get rid of the NYX apple strudel lip gloss so i'm just going to get rid of that and here we have the rest of my lip glosses and i'm honestly not ready to part ways with any of these so i'm gonna keep all of them so here we have some liquid lipsticks that are like drugstore and i also have some lancome ones here i'm going to do a full like uh, liquid lipstick video so the ones that i'm going to get rid of now is because i don't like them but i think i'm gonna just keep them for the video but then i'm going to get rid of them so these uh, lancome matte shakers i really 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 don't like i really I really don't like them. I, I got sent all of these which were so nice of Lancome to do um, but I just tried one color and this is color beige vintage. Oh this one I tried and I really have not had good luck with it. It doesn't last on my lips. It look just it does not look good on lips so I don't want to keep any of these. These two from L'Oreal we have the lip paint in lacquer and the matte one. This one is in darling pink and the more red one is called apocalypse red. I want to give both of these a chance because I honestly haven't tried any of them so I want to try them so I'm going to keep them because I haven't tried them. This one I'm going to get rid of. This is the Sleek Matte Me Lip Cream in Birthday Suit. This is too dry for me and I don't like the wand on it. So I'm going to get rid of that one. So this one I've had for I think 7 or 8 months now. And I still haven't reached for it. So I'm going to get rid of this one. I just don't like it too much. This one I haven't gotten to try yet. This is the Maybelline Vivid Matte Liquid. So I'm going to give that one a shot before I get rid of it. And then we have the um, the Body Shop Matte Liquid Lip. I wasn't a fan of this and I hate the scent. The scent is too too much for me. So And I, I didn't like the formula or anything like that. So I'm going to get rid of the, the Body Shop one as well. Here we have some random lip product. These two from Giorgio Armani I have a hard time getting rid of. Especially this one, the long one, which is called Lip Mastro. So I'm going to keep that one. I haven't actually tried it, but I'm going to keep that one. I'm also going to keep this YSL Vanille Cream. This one, which is called Lip Magnet. I just don't see myself ever reaching for a color like that. So, I don't know. I might get rid of it. Then we have this one from Revlon. This is their Colorstay Liquid Lipstick. I'm going to get rid of that one. So, here we have some lip pencils. So, we have two from uh, e.l.f. These are really, really good. These are the matte lip colors. And I'm definitely keeping Tea Rose. Tea Rose I really like. I don't really reach for this color called Coral. Sorry, I just had to put this box back here because it wanted to focus on that um, clear container. So... If you're wondering why this is randomly there. I just don't reach for it ever. So I am going to get rid of it. Then we have the Bite Beauty Matte Lip Crayon. I love, love, love these. It's just a beautiful, beautiful everyday shade. Then we have these NYX Lip Duos. And I don't really use the lip liners or any on any of them. 
um, because I think there is too big of a contrast between the lip color and the lip pencil. But I really like the lipstick on the uh, cookies and cream one and also on the ginger and nutmeg. I love this one. But this one I don't really reach for. This is the color cinnamon and spice. So I'm going to get rid of cinnamon and spice. Then I have this little mini lipstick from Bite Beauty which includes musk lache or something like that this is just a very nice little duo um i think i'm just going to get rid of this then we have these two lip pencils these i have one from revlon one from isadora i'm gonna keep both of these i really like them so now i can see uh, i still have my lip liners left i have to go through those but uh, now I have things stored like this. I'm not sure if it's like my favorite way to store it, but as you can see, I have room for more, which I don't know if that's a good idea, but um, so I have to put some of these in here. This is NYX uh, Soft Matte Lip Creams and some Lancrem Liquid Lipsticks, just because unless all of these will just like fall down. And here I just have my lip glosses now, other lip things, some liquid lipsticks, and now I'm going to go through my lip liners. Oh my god. This is crazy. So here we have my more nudie mauve shades, and I love my Urban Decay ones, so I'm going to keep all of my Urban Decay ones. By the way, I have to show you guys something really weird. Both of these two are called Naked. Like, isn't that weird? It's like the same thing. Both of them are like real, like none of them are like from eBay. I don't know if this is like the old naked and this is a new one. I don't know, but but I like them both, so I'm gonna keep them both. Same with this one. This one I'm actually not the biggest fan of Max Subculture, but I'm not ready to part ways with it yet. So I'm gonna keep it. I'm also gonna keep my Kylie lip liners. I think the nude ones are really good, but only thing that really annoys me is that they fall out like this, like all of them. I really like the formula, so I'm gonna keep those. So here we have one that I don't really use ever. I don't think I've ever used it. And this one is in the color Sweet Angel. I don't know. I just never reach for it, so I'm going to get rid of that. I have these. I got all of the Lancome lip liners, and I haven't tried any of them yet, so I'm definitely going to try them. This is my Jordana Easy Liner in Tawny. I really, really like that one. Um, I can't find my cap, but I like it. This one I haven't tried yet. This is the The Body Shop Lip Definer. I have to try that one. This one I quite like. This is from the brand Honey Pot in the color Toffee. I really like it, but I don't think this is a brand that is like easy to get your hands on. So I never really talk about it or use it because of that. So I think I'm just going to get rid of it because none of you guys can get your hands on it. And that's no fun. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Iconic Nude. Love these lip liners. Definitely keeping that one. This one used to be like my favorite lip liner ever. But now they stopped selling gosh in norway so i can't really get my hands on this one and again this is a brand that is not that easy to get your hands on other places in the world so i'm just gonna get rid of it but if you can get your hands on this one this is the gosh nugget crisp lip liner it's amazing it used to be my favorite one here we have some bright ones from lancome i'm gonna keep those i have some light pink pink shades which i really like these all of these this one i might just get rid of this is from the brand flamar this is in the color 201 so i think i'm just gonna get rid of it i got my use out of it as you can see and now i have these two that i like better and they're beautiful so i'm just gonna get rid of that one here we have another really nice pinky nude this is 702 from shiseido love that one my two my two red ones i'm gonna keep cherry and one from lancome i'm gonna keep i'm going to keep these darker ones from urban decay and also this white one it's not white but it's like a clear lip liner i really want to try that one and here i have my really light nude lip liners which I really like the Walk of Shame one. This is the Revlon Color Stay Lip Liner in Natural, and I just never reach for it. It's just a little bit too sheer, not that pigmented. I'm just going to get rid of that one. So here we have five lip liners that I'm not going to keep, and I didn't get rid of that many, but it's better than nothing, so I don't have lip liners that I never use, so... I'm gonna get rid of these. So I have these Bronx Matte Lip Tints. I really, really like this color, this one. This is in the color number 10. I love this, I'm gonna keep that one. I also kind of like this nude shade, but to be honest, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it. I don't think actually I'm gonna use it. And these darker ones, like this one, I know I don't need. This one looks very similar to Huda Beauty Famous, so I'm gonna get rid of that one. And I might also get rid of this dark one so this is kind of a cool shade um and i don't think i have a liquid lipstick in that color so i might keep it so i think i'm gonna keep these two 
This is number one and number 10 I'm gonna keep, and then I'm going to get rid of number nine, which I love this color, but I just have other colors that I like more, and number two. So getting rid of these and keeping those two. So I'm just gonna put these in here. So, so far, this is how my lip, lip floor looks like. And uh, yeah, so also I have, of course, this thing that you guys have seen before. I have some lip products in here as well. So yeah, but I'm not gonna touch those because I actually do use those a lot. So now I just counted all of my lipsticks that I'm getting rid of and I'm actually getting rid of 40 lipsticks. I can't believe I got rid of that many. So now I'm just gonna organize it into trash and things I'm gonna give to either friends or family. So that was it for this declutter video. I really hope you guys liked it. If you liked it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Here we have my swatch. I'm gonna swatch the liquid lipstick, but. So I hope you guys are excited for more declutter videos. And of course I'm gonna post normal videos as well. Not only these videos, but I know you guys like these, but I'm gonna post them like, like here and there. And uh, yeah, so I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.